before I go picking in the morning when I wake up, I, I make a decision that I'm going picking. So I say my meditation in the morning and ask that I be able to find healthy plants and, and, and be guided to the right areas and, and go out in a good way. So I clear my mind and clear my thoughts. And then when I'm out here, I ask that Creator guide me to open up my heart, have my heart connect with my mind, and have my mind and my heart connect with spirit. Ask spirit to guide me on my journey and give thanks to Mother Earth for the abundance that she gives us and the way she supports us with food and nutrition and with our health and beauty. I've been a, a wild crafter and a gatherer pretty well all my life. My grandmother was a gatherer as well. So my mother grew up gathering food and hunting food and fishing food for the family. With my nursing experience, I've now gathered knowledge to use the plants for medicine. I guess I'd like to remind people that a lot of our scientific medicines come from natural medicine. In the springtime, I gather sting and nettle. Sting and nettle is classified as one of our superfoods, and it provides us with all of our nutritional values that we should need in the way of trace minerals, vitamins, and it is a rebuilder for our red blood cells. And then I gather dandelion that I use a lot for the medicinal properties as well. We have been picking here for hundreds of years and our plants and our woods and our forests are still intact. So it's nice to be able to take care of those pieces because they're getting very sparse around Mother Earth today. My name is June Johnson and I'm from the Cape Mudge Band. Forestry was always our pharmacy. We never had a pharmacy it was in the forest where we got all our traditional plants for healing. The first time that I did uh, get involved with it was a little girl. I got a cut on my foot and my mom uh, told me to soak it. And so I did and she went and left for about half an hour and came back with some pitch. And she heated it up on the stove and put it in the gauze and put it on my foot. And the next day it was cleared. I didn't have an infection. It's a strong healer. It's from the Sitka spruce tree. This is Devil's Club. It's really good for gout. It brings your sugar level down with diabetes. When I do make the tea, I always use spring water. More and more people are quite interested in the traditional medicines. It's really part of my life. It's also an inner healer for me to be able to share what I've learned. And I'm teaching my granddaughter. I feel uh, with nature. It's right in my element because our people look after the land, the water, the trees, the animals. They're all part of our culture. All I want to do is bring it back to our people.